at this point all of them need to be put in handcuffs and made to take the perp walk you cannot tell me that they did not know what sean combs was doing in the background for over 30 years the 12th allegation are you serious now think about all the women and men who haven't come forward yet i'll be back Okay, let's get into this. Um, it's like I really don't have too many words because Hollywood is filled with so much vile and wickedness. And as I keep saying, and I'm going to continue saying that it's not just Diddy. There are other men and women up there doing what he's doing and worse. I'm reading a BBC News article that was published yesterday and it says... Sean Diddy Combs facing more allegations of sexual assault. The hip hop mongol Sean Diddy Combs has been accused of drugging and sexually assaulting a woman in another lawsuit filed in New York. The 12th and latest accuser alleges that after she became pregnant, she was harassed by one of his associates to have to basically eliminate the pregnancy and she later miscarried of course he continues to deny the allegations the article didn't say that i just added that in there he continues to deny allegations of criminal wrongdoing the bbc has approached his attorney our lawyer and asked for a comment on a late on a latest civil lawsuit what does the latest lawsuit say in the latest lawsuit filed against him in New York, a woman referred to as Jane Doe describes repeated physical and he was abusing her. And, you know, the other way. For over a period of four years, beginning in late 2020, she says she first met the rapper who paid for her travel at an overseas location. And the two began seeing each other regularly. After that, according to the lawsuit, in her legal complaint, the woman alleges she was drugged by Mr. Combs, who would then engage in S acts with her without her consent while she was unconscious. You cannot tell me that this man was not involved in sex magic. And sex magic is entailed sex magic is the use of sexual activity for magical spiritual or ritualistic purposes sex magicians believe that sexual energy is, is a powerful force that can be used to alter reality mm. you cannot tell me this man is not involved in that either he's a sex hound he got some serious issues in the sex department or he's doing sex magic practicing sex magic the s encounters were filmed by combs without the woman's permission and she was pressured by him to engage in group s with others the legal document claims in one instance alleged to have apparently taken place in july 2022 the lawsuit describes the woman being compelled to take the drug ketamine which caused her to black out and lose consciousness intermittently throughout the night shortly afterward it alleges the woman found out she was pregnant according to the lawsuit when the woman informed combs of her pregnancy an associate of combs harassed her to end the pregnancy the woman later suffered a miscarriage it says the woman further alleges that Mr. Combs made threatening jokes that led her to fear for her safety, says he monitored her location and phone conversations, and says he discouraged her from working so 
So he could pay her an allowance instead. And I saw a video, I saw part of a video yesterday where this man was describing how Diddy would, um, he would monitor the women he was involved with. He would, it was like a control thing. He would, he would have people watching everything they did and follow them everywhere they went. No one is above the law. Fame and wealth do not protect Sean Diddy Combs from serious allegations of sex trafficking and abuse, said the woman's lawyer. Mr. Combs has faced a string of allegations in the past year following on from the lawsuit both by his ex-girlfriend Cassie Ventura last November. The rapper is also facing criminal charges. Okay, they're just repeating what's going on now. The rapper has pleaded not guilty. So here's the thing. At this point, everybody should be pissed at Hollywood, period. Hollywood is a den of iniquities. And for this man to be so comfortable to do what he was doing in the background for over 30 years, you know a lot of people are complicit. And I'm going to keep stressing that. Everybody who is involved, people who turn a blind eye, people who rather get paid, they rather have gotten paid than tell the truth. People who just quit and, and never said a word. You could have sent an anonymous letter. You didn't have to, you know, you didn't have to put your name to it. And then somebody would have been made to go and investigate it. But you guys, and then law enforcement, you're going to tell me. All these cameras around major cities and you didn't see anything? Nobody knew nothing, right? In the meantime, y'all arresting folks for to just walking wrong, just walking down the street on the wrong day. And this man and whoever else was with him, the other people, men and women who were with him, who knew what he was doing and participating in what he was doing, they just get to, you know wake up every morning and just do the same thing harassing terrifying people destroying people lives and ending people lives all right when i i'm just going to keep I, like i said i i talked about diddy i think earlier this year or last year but i had cut it out because they just kept repeating the same thing and i didn't want to keep repeating the same thing so i said once they start unfolding more things I are more evidence I will come start bringing more videos so look like this year is gonna just be filled with Diddy so um yeah whenever I see something else in regards to him that I think is interesting I'll bring it to you guys regardless of what's going on with Diddy I'm still working on um other content as well and some of it is linked to Diddy too some of it is not but hey, thank you for your time, attention, and I will see you in the next video.